What's up YouTube, this is Tutorial TV, and today we're going to go over cropping and resizing in Premiere Pro. So we're just going to open up the software, I've got two clips ready to go. So we're just going to drag the first one in. This is an unboxing with Canon T3i, you'll eventually see it, um, although the T3i is very outdated. Um, so you'll notice, um, this is 1080p footage and we're working in a 720p project. So your footage is not always going to match your sequence settings, especially when you're using multiple different types of footage in a project. It's not going to happen that often, but it'll, you'll come across it fairly often. So you want to know how to deal with it. Now what you can either do is just click it and zoom out to say 25% and you'll notice it's way, it's way zoomed in right now. So all, all you have to do is take your selection tool and just crop it down to wherever you like. Obviously you don't want to have black edges around the outside but uh, it's it's a very simple fix right there so let's just say you want to get it exactly on the mark you want to get the exact edges lined up so you're gonna, get, gonna want to do is right click your footage down in the timeline and go to scale to frame size and there you go it is perfectly framed around your sequence settings which is very nice it's a very helpful tool so you don't you can keep it fit um, to the timeline or to the video monitor and then you don't have to zoom out and, and mess around with that you can get it perfectly every time alright so now let's go over picture and picture that's when you have you can display two different videos at the same time so you're gonna wanna drag this clip either above or below it it doesn't matter and we're gonna scale it to frame size so that we can uh, use our, our width adjusters scale to frame size and now we can adjust and see now we can see both and now we can go back to this one adjust this one and we can see both we can do whatever we want with them we can make you know this one uh, the full size and in that case we can go to scale the frame size which it already is so we can not uh, readjust that so we can make this the full size and then we can drag this above it and you know put it wherever we want I don't know why these clips are completely unrelated so this is kind of a strange video but you get the idea whenever you want to use it um, it's it's very simple you just you have one clip on top of the other and there you go um, layers in Premiere Pro are just like layers in Photoshop layers in Illustrator layers in pretty much any software I've used so it's really easy um, and yeah so if you guys would like any tutorial requests from Premiere Pro, Photoshop, After Effects, or Illustrator, I'm not great with Illustrator, but I can figure it out, then just leave a comment, send a private message, whatever you, you want to do to get me the message, and I will be sure to make that. Thank you guys for watching, and I will see you later.